Happy New Year, guys. Um, I thought I would share some information on some newer product. It is the Hartley Group out of North Carolina. This product is pronounced ECRU or ECRO. Um, I sometimes am having a hard time with that. It's bio-based. It's a 2K polyurethane. This is the color we went with today. First time using it. Sherwin-Williams peppercorn in a satin finish. Uh, this is their 1300 top coat, and they also have a primer that we used over here, and this is their um, 414T, uh, which I believe stands for tannin blocking. It's a 1K primer. You can catalyze that as well, 10%. Let me show you what we did with this, guys. So we did a couple different areas. This is our first area in here that we did with this product. And my apologies for not being the best at videoing. It's a very good product. Um, we will find out Monday when we reassemble how it holds up we'll do a scratch test on it here's all of the doors and drawer fronts that we did now keep in mind um, we ordered two weeks ago with the snowstorms that hit quite a bit of the uh, the nation um, this arrived late via UPS and what we ended up doing on this one is we shot a first coat of Malaysi and Centurion primers that we had in the shop and um, Then we came with the second coat with the uh, Ecru primer and with the Ecru primer uh, They mistakenly didn't tint it dark, but no worries this product covers amazingly well uh, After it tightened up too, there's no transparencies and I know as a rule of thumb you should get a primer that is practically the same color as your top coat for hiding purposes. But uh, we missed on this one. No sweat. This covered amazingly well. Amazingly well. Dries fast. Here's the second area, guys, that we did. Tons of work on this one. The customer allowed us into their house right after Christmas. And the nice thing about this particular product, guys, oh, by the way, here's the garage where we sprayed this out. Give you guys a quick view on there. Right inside that bubble, heated garage, we heated it up. And each individual door we would bring in all the way back there. We sprayed this out. With our Tritec T4, I just finished the kitchen boxes. Flows out beautifully. Let's take a peek here, guys, for all of you interested in a bio-based 2K polyurethane. It sprays out really, really well. Seems to have a little bit less pressure that needs to be utilized versus a Renner or a Malaysi or even a Centurion. And what I noticed about this product is um, less pressure, less sags. Using our same techniques that we did with our other products, there is less little runs and little sags, those little finicky spots that you always get on your cabinet projects, no matter what, where you find a little run or a sag. And gosh, we had but a couple, and yet amazingly, same techniques of spraying, and this was a white primer. Their Ecru primer, like I said, un they didn't tint it, they forgot. 
we had requested that tinted to a dark gray and uh, they forgot on that because they wanted to ship that out but that's okay because this dark color here covered very very well and as it tightens up I don't see any transparencies I went over everything looked at it before I did this video and I'm impressed a shout out to the Hartley group Hartley Italia North Carolina uh, the lady who's been helping me out Stephanie and also Jeff Takic Takic Jeff I apologize if I didn't pronounce your last name correctly you've been a trooper helping me out answering all my questions uh, this is a this is a good product guys We'll test it out to determine if it uh, it holds up with scratching and so forth, but I am thoroughly impressed. Uh, this just, it hangs much better than the Malaysi, the Renner, or the Centurion, which are my favorite three. And yet, first time using this one, gosh, this is a winner, guys. It's priced compatible to Renner Malaysi. So give the customer a good product, they'll have to pay for it, don't worry about that. In the end, they get a fantastic result that they'll be pleased with. This one was oak too, very heavy grained. When we're finished, I'll post some photos, yet I can honestly say that um, with the first coat of primer, which was the Centurion. We sprayed it, we back rolled it to get it into the grain. And then uh, the second coat of primer uh, that we did, the Ecro, uh, we cross hatched it. It covered up the rest of the grain really, really well. So I'm impressed. I'm impressed with this one, guys. So by no means are we the best out there, but yet this this makes us better than we really are give this one a shot talk to Stephanie Hartley Italia North Carolina set up your account and you guys can get this one fairly soon we were fortunate to speak with Jeff and order this about two weeks ago again shipping delays UPS because of bad bad winter storms no sweat we made it work give yourselves plenty of time if you're shipping to the West Coast, I would give it three weeks just to play it safe. And you'll be just fine. We'll put it back together Monday. Today's Friday. And there you go. Happy New Year, guys. Make it a good one. Feel free to contact us. MRP Painting out in Denver, Colorado. And we can answer any questions you might have about this product. We were impressed. See ya.